Your next question is, uh, what was the treatment of my wife's uh, skin cancer or generally was the treatment of a skin cancer? So first of all, the most important part is on you because it has to be you who uh, has the suspicion that something is going on on your skin. So you spot something suspicious or even better, without any suspicion, you just turn up on a mole check and let the doctor decide whether you have anything suspicious or not. The next step is a clinical diagnosis. So obviously the doctor uses their dermatoscope and based on dermatoscopic signs, they come up with a clinical diagnosis, whether this is a basal cell carcinoma, a melanoma or a benign skin tumor. In case of a clinical suspicion of a malignant skin tumor, in my wife's case, a basal cell carcinoma, but it can be a melanoma. The next step is verification. So typically it's called uh, an excisional biopsy when you remove the whole lesion with a narrow 2-3 millimeter uh, safety margin. And the tissue is sent to a pathology lab where they analyze it and they provide you with a histological uh, analysis uh, result and it says yes it was a BCC, it was a melanoma or it was whatever and based on that uh, written diagnosis you know <clears throat> the next step. So for example if you remove a melanoma with two millimeter safety margin then you know a further excision is coming because one centimeter margin should be kept as a minimum. In case of a bas basal cell carcinoma, it's half a centimeter, but in my wife's case, due to the very superficial nature, I just used uh, cauterization. Again, the most important step is on you with the clinical suspicion.